Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Mega Man 2 on the Mega Man Legacy Collection. In the last one, we took care of three robot masters. Flash Man first, because he kept flashing himself in front of everybody. Quick Man, because he takes he finishes things too quickly. Crash Man, because he keeps making cars crash on the interstates. And so now we gotta give we gotta get these other ones committing uh, crimes and whatnot. We'll see which one we're tackling next here. Actually, uh, who is usually my first... The first one I usually hit to hit up is Flash Man, Quick Man, Crash Man. We got the Crash Bombs. So who is weak to the Crash Bombs? Actually, you know what? I don't, it's probably Metal Man, but we're going to tackle him anyways. He is actually a really good first Robot Master. To go, the really good uh, Robot Master for your first one. Because the Metal Blades are probably some of... If not one of, or if if, it's, if it is not the most OP, it is one of the most OP weapons in the entirety of Mega Man history. And especially, there is a method you can use to cheese it, uh, to practically have infinite energy if you're okay with a slow and tedious process. You know what, fuck it, I already got hit by that. There we go. And, fuck. These things do a lot of damage too, and Mega Man has some weird, has a weird slide too. After some momentum, he doesn't instantly stop. As you see, take like a little tiny slide there, and sometimes you can run into shit because of that. And it's just as you know, piss off worthy. I fucking hate it sometimes. That's all I'm trying to say. All right, we're just gonna grind here for a bit, see if I can get some energy. Hopefully, they can drop some lives and whatnot too. I mean, I had no problem doing this in the Game Boy version of Mega Man Two. Fucking A. Be nice. Come on. Drop something for me. I should have specified. Alright, give me the big ones. Give me the big ones. Please give me the big ones. You don't want to give me the big ones? Fine. Screw you. Ow. Oh! I did not mean to do that. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. How many lives am I at? Okay, we're cool. We're cool. Alright, I'll see you back there in a minute. Wait. Yeah, I'll see you back there in a minute. Of course I get the big fucking energy when I don't fucking need it. Why, why would I expect anything different from this game? Alright, so we're back. There we go. Don't need to get that life up there, it's fine. Don't even have the right item for it anyways. Beautiful, just keep jumping around, shaking and baking like it ain't no thing. There we go. Destroy the cylinders if you can. And destroy the little... Ooh. Now, see, if that space was just a little bit bigger, I would have been screwed. Thank you. All right. So, two shots. Beautiful. There's the E tank, but if I get it, I would means I would have to die. Hmm. Am I in a mood to die? I already got two. No, I'm good. Bean. Okay. Ah! There we go. All right, finally made it to Metal Metal Man. Once again, jump through the door like a true Mega Man fan. And this one, I just basically like to jump and shoot. He's going to throw Metal Blades at you. Just do your best to avoid it. From the time to time, he will flash, which will cause a conveyor belt on the bottom to switch direction. You want to be... You want that... Okay, I just jumped right into that. You want that conveyor belt to go in the direction... Uh, you want it to go in against you, so that way you stay against the wall. That way you don't have to worry, have to worry about trying to damage him and making sure your positioning is not affected by blades. Mm 
Ow. If you get close enough to uh, Metal Man, he will jump to the other side, so it's just be a good idea to take take that to your advantage. Beautiful. I'm pretty sure one more saw blade would have killed me, and I'm pretty sure that was my last life. Why did I think I can go all Rambo? Get equipped with OP Blade. All right. So now that we got Metal Man taken care of, what slices through metal? Well. You take a saw blade, you run it through a tree, you kill the wood. So, we gotta go to Woodman next. But yeah, as I mentioned, Metal Blade is an OP weapon. Why? Because you essentially can throw three Metal Blades. Let me just... If you look at the uh, bar up top here, you can throw three Metal Blades. And on your fourth one, it'll go down by one. If you do it, pause it, reselect the weapon, you have another three free shots before... Actually, you don't even need to switch out to another weapon. Keep the same weapon, shoot three, and you don't have to worry about, you know, pretty much losing a weapon energy on that. A little slow and tedious, but like I said, it's OP for a reason. No! Oh, damn bug bunny rabbit. Don't know what Dr. Wilder was thinking with metal rabbits. But that's okay. We got these bats here, which don't make no damn sense either. Well, I mean... Well, can bats live in the woods? I would think they can. Because they live in caves in the woods. So... Technicality. Look, I'm not the sharpest tool sometimes, so don't even bother. Don't even pay attention to what I say half the, cra the crap I say. Beautiful. Ow. Okay. That was a little more bad. You kind of have to circle around a bit, but it's fine. Yeah, I am on my last life. That's pretty damn ballsy of me to try to freaking continue to stage like that. Cool. I don't need big weapon energy. I need big life energy. And Mega Man's trying to go for that big dick energy, too. Oh, boy. There we go. Oh, actually, you know what? The Metal Blades are good for that. So instead of just... Can I get life... Please, I need some life. I need life. Don't take away my life from me. Metal blades also shoot eight ways. Oh, come on! Whatever. Down the ladder. Wee! There we go. You can actually make the Metal Blade your base weapon for throughout the entire run if you want. Ow. And I still let the fucking... Okay. We're probably in the home stretch of the level here, so we should be good. Okay, where we can just fucking do that. That's cool. That's that's fucking cool too. Uh, that's fine. I, no, that's that's cool. That's cool. 
I, li I like it when I fucking get my life taken away. I don't give a shit. I forgot I had zero lives coming into this. I am not going through this entire stage again. That's not even the right weapon. He's weak to heat, man. But you can use Metal Blades. It works just as effective. I guess. Oof. There we go. Yeah, the Metal Blades, like I said, I said four or five times already about it, it bears repeating. They're OP. Even though Heat Man is the proper uh, weakness for Wood Man, you can still do quite a bit of damage with the Metal Blade for any Robot Master. And I think, as well, this is the only game... If, if it's not this one, it's the next one. Uh, Mega Man 3. But I think it's one of those two where actually the Robot Masters are weak to their own weapons. Um, never mind. Let's just go ahead and get to the stage select here. So... So we got Metal Man, actually bu Bubble Man. That was what should have been tackled next. But you know what? We got some time. Let's go ahead and tackle Bubble Man anyway. What's his crime? I don't know. Blowing bubbles in the river? Oh, that's a whole lot of blue. And that's going to be a whole lot of death. Let's just make sure to get my lives reset. Let's go. I forgot how much blue that there was in this one. And the back. Ah. Whew. Okay. As long as there is a tiny toad on screen, doesn't matter. Uh, but the, big, the giant toad won't spew out anymore until all the little ones on screen are taken away. How come that second one didn't fall? Oh! There we go. Not even gonna bother with them. And we got shrimps! We got all the shrimps! We got the anglerfish. Give me, why am I not taking out the metal blades? There we go. We killed the fish dead. You know it's dead because its eyeballs went out. Roll to the back of his head. There we go. Ooh! Gotta be careful with those spikes. They are a one-hit kill for some reason. Ooh! There we go. Just kill that one. Mega Man's body cannot touch a single spike. Does that apply to toothpicks? Does that apply to cones? What are we talking here? What are the limits with that shit? Can you get vaccines? I mean, what's the problem? Alright. There we go. Method works. Beautiful. And now we are at Bubble Man himself. And now we jump through. It's Bubble Man! He's going to jump, shoot some bubbles at you. There we go. And he's well taken care of. Get equipped with... Bubble Lead! Guaranteed to give you guaranteed health problems and potential lawsuits in the near future. Stage select here. We are down to two robot la masters. Heat Man, Air Man, and then we'll tackle on Dr. Dr. We're going to tackle Dr. Wily. 
in the next episode. So until then, do like to thank you guys for watching. Hope you have yourselves a fantabulous day. Love, peace, chicken grease, good night.